Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2021 Tops Inception Baseball. 16 box, pick your team number two from jazbeescasebreaks.com. A very big thanks to these amazing people here. Thanks for hanging with us on a Wednesday on a new release day. Thanks for getting into all of the action. We appreciate it. I think I have all the supplies I need here. Just the top camera right there. All right, let's pop this open, see what we got. All right, good luck, everyone. We were talking a little... Uh, we're talking a little uh, NCAA basketball. I know it's a baseball break, but that's the big sporting event coming up. Jose's thinking Kansas State. K is that what KS is? I don't know college stuff very well. Ohio State or, or North Carolina to, to win it all? All right, so the hit's on the bottom. Vlad, Hansa Alberto, Sixto Sanchez, who could be a Rookie of the Year candidate. All right, and, ooh, nice patch, nice autograph, Evan White. 11 out of 75, Mariners, Jorge with the M's. Yush is a Shoei Otani stan, but apparently there's talk about him taking the Hex Double Crown. So he's going to win the... No, that's not going to happen. He's not going to get enough at-bats for the, for the hitting Triple Crown. And he's not going to pitch enough games to, uh, to get the pitching Triple Crown. So I don't know if that's going to happen. But it would be, I mean, if it did, that means, I feel like a lot of, that means a lot of team, or a lot of players are having not so good years. There's Juan Soto for the Nats, Ed Garretts. There's Alec Baum and Ozzy Albies. Is 120 games worth of hitting enough, though, to, to get triple crown numbers? Average, you can probably qualify and get average, right? But someone's going to hit, like, 45 home runs. The RBI, I feel like RBIs is where he'll fall short. There's Dylan Cease, 33 out of 99. I guess I could see him leading the league in average or... And and maybe home runs. But do you think he'll, he'll, think he'll get the RBIs? There's Dylan Cease for David and the White Sox. SEL, what's up? Looking for the Cabrian Hayes. All right, yeah, that's all. That's Adam. Adam H. with the Cardinals. Or no, sorry. Ben Young with the Pirates. Yeah, I think RBIs would be the hardest. I think he ends up with like, I don't know, 80, 75, 80 RBIs. Right, with the limited ABs. And you know someone's going to get like 120 or something like that. All right. And DJ LeMayhew might win the batting batting title in the AL. So that might screw up Otani. But yeah, he's the, he, I mean, really, he's he is the closest player that could could get a triple crown in both, though. Yeah, Barry's right, though. He's got to stay healthy. There's Trevor Rogers, 113 out of 249. Marlins. I guess if he stays healthy, all things are possible. Marlins, Matt Stubblefield with that one. Next box. Hey, there he is right there. Show it time. 
There's Jose Barrios to 150. There's Shohei Otani. That last season wasn't very good, but I guess he's looking pretty good in uh, in spring training, though. Jose Barrios will go to Minnesota. That's going to be uh, for Travis. And we've got Enoli Paredes. 99 out of 249. Charles with the Astros. Yeah, big. I mean, big season for Aaron Judge. He's got to. He's got to show that he could stay healthy on the regular. But if 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 the Yankees can get like can get uh, Judge and Giancarlo Stanton healthy at the same time, I uh, seventy five Vlad Guerrero. That could be really dangerous. All right, here's a Cabrian Hayes rookie card for Ben and the Pirates. Let's see if we can find his autograph. Joe Adele could be a big name in the hobby this year. Nicholas with the Angels. And Vlad Guerrero Jr. to 75. I'd like to see like Guerrero J Vlad make like an MVP run. That'd be hashtag good for the hobby. And then we got Brian Garcia for the Tigers. 40 out of 125, rookie auto for Tyler Brenner and Detroit. All right, next one. Sanchez, Nolan Arenado, two out of 75. That'll be for the Rockies, Jarrell with the Rocks. Now we've got Christian Javier, 124 out of 125. Astros Auto going to Charles. It'll be for Charles and the next box. Well, who needs to lose? Oh, Vlad? Yeah, I think he did. Yeah. He he's he apparently lost like 30, 40 pounds in the off season. Alright. Garrett Cole, seven forty seven out of fifty. Spencer Howard. And there's Kevin Biggio speaking of the Blue Jays. 26 out of 50. So Blue Jays got got the sons of ball player Biggio, Bichette, Vlad Guerrero Jr. Guerrero. Toronto, Ricky J with the Blue Jays. So that'll be, it'll be kind of fun to see that that team really take it to the next level. Yeah, Yush, resident Jays, is saying he looks a lot thinner and his launch angle is up. So good. That's hashtag good for the hobby. Maybe, maybe get those uh, Vlad Grow rookie cards ready to roll on the secondary market. Especially if he starts off the season hot. All right. There's Nick Madrigal rookie card. That'll be for the White Sox, David. And behind Goldschmidt is going to be William Contreras. 88 out of 99. Wilson's uh, younger brother, I think. There you go. 
Blue Jays also have Kyle Drabeck, as in the son of of Doug Drabeck. I think that was his name, Doug. I I see in my head Doug Drabeck is a pirate. You see you, Mike. Yeah, Doug Drabeck, Pirate All-Star, maybe? Oh, he's washed out. Oh, he was that, was that was back in the day. Uh, 69 out of 99, Braylon Marquez. There's Joey Bart, Joey Bart rookie card. You know what you do have? You sh uh, is a Clemens. I think there's a Clemens in the Blue Jays organization. Joey Bart rookie card for Matthew and the Braylon Marquez for the Cubs. And behind Lindor is going to be a nice patch, nice auto. 18 out of 25, Jordan Alvarez. Or the Houston H right there. That's going to go to Charles and the Strohs. Cody Clemens? Casey Clemens? There's a Clemens in there, some in that organization somewhere. All right, first half of the case done. Second half coming up. This is Picker Team Two. All right, Justin Verlander to one fifty. Casey Mize rookie card. And behind Javier Baez is going to be a Pete Alonzo autograph on the card. 13 out of 75. I pulled a Pete Alonzo in the last case I was doing. Here's another Pete for Tayon Bruce and the Mets. There you go, Tayon. Nice. All right, next box. Pearson, there's another, another youngster on the Blue Jays that could really break out this season. And behind Trevor Story is another nice patch, nice autograph, Jazz Chisholm. 42 out of 199. Who has the fish? Matthew Stubblefield with the Marlins. There you go, Matthew. That's right, you should. Unless you're the son of a former ball player or playing offensive line on a football team, heavy, you're not playing for the Jays. That's all they draft. It's like, oh, son of a ball player, we'll take you. We'll take, we'll take Phil Nevin's kid. We'll take, I don't know who else is out there, Clemens's kids. Behind Altuve is another nice patch. 24 out of 25, Luis Garcia for the Nationals. Man, these Inception patches have been wild. Ed Garrett, there you go, Ed, with the Nats. Wow. Korkmaz hits... A game tying three, leaving point four on the clock. For the Sixers, Cork Moss. Wow. Clutch Moss. See that three? They inbound it from the corner. One, one dribble, fires it up, sinks it. 
was pretty impressive. Yeah, why were they going for the steal? All right. Two color patch auto. We were just talking about a little bit. 14 out of 50. Aaron Judge, all rise. There's Ed. No worries, Ed. Thank you for getting in. Good to see you. You got a bit of the pinstripe on the left side. Maybe a piece of the number or some lettering or something. Nice autograph. Jeff Dorlack with the Yankees. There you go, Jeff. Ed, you needed him to go into OT? Are this game to go to OT? Are you on the over? Yes, he is, Barry. All right. Ooh, do we have double hits here? Oh, we got a double. We got a double hit here, folks. Two autographs. All right. There's Bo Bichette. Autograph one. David Peterson, 144 out of 200. That's for Tan and the Mets. All right, and behind Carlos Correa, I think is a silver ink autograph. It is Alec Baum, nice. 005 out of 100, silver ink rookie auto Alec Baum. Although I think he he gobbled up his rookie eligibility last year. He was a Rookie of the Year finalist. But his rookie cards are this year. There you go. Phillies. Garrett with the fight in Phils. Nice. Hi, Brent. No, I did not see any uh, no Indians yet. But we have two boxes to go. At least two more autos to go. Oh, DFS. You, you, you have Giannis on your daily fantasy lineup. All right, nice trout. And behind Xander Bogarts is, is Randy Dobnek for the Twins. 86 out of 199, three color patch. You've got a little bit of gold peeking out on the left side. Um, Travis with the Twins. All right, final box. Pick your team two. Good luck. Brian Lau to 75. Jake Cronenworth had a good season last year, too. Padres, that'll be for Alex. Brian Lau for the Rays, that'll be for Michael DiPaolo. And the last one here is for the Astros, Blake Taylor. 14 out of 25, Blake Taylor for the Astros going to Charles with the Strohs. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was Pick Your Team 2, brand new, 2021 Tops Inception Baseball. Just dropped today. Get into the action on jazpyscasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.